Hey there, SaaS community. Today we're going to explore a great tool for networking on LinkedIn to boost your profile views and connect with people in your same industry. And if you're interested, let's dive right in. And our powerful tool's name is Power In, which will revolutionize the way you connect with people in your industry. And here's what you can do with it. You can automate your LinkedIn comments. And you might wonder, why do I need to automate my LinkedIn comments? Because you will have the interaction with people in your industry all day and night, and you just do not need to worry. You will simply get started in minutes and you'll enjoy the benefits forever. Uh, more specifically, you will be noticed by people you, you have never thought of because you will uh, consistently leave comments on their posts and then you will attract their audiences and you will get uh, consequently more profile views. So um, let's see what we can do here and test the features in action. For that, we simply log in or sign up if you're using it for the first time here. And this dashboard will appear on your screen. And first of all, you will need to um, set up your LinkedIn account here on this target section. Let's do that. And here we've got a couple of steps that we need to follow. First of all, we need to add this extension to our um, Chrome. So let's do that. And after adding the extension, it will automatically connect it to our LinkedIn account that we are right now logged in. And this is what we have now. And here you can see my LinkedIn account connected to Power In. And we can start with some basic configurations, uh, which is my account settings. Um, we can start changing our voice gender. In this case, it's female. Then we can choose to turn on the emojis. If we want to add some friendliness to our comments, let's do that. Then we can turn on the hashtags for better exposure and appearance and targeting. Let's do that. And we can choose to pause the comments automatically. So if you want to connect with people in your industry all day and night, and then you can turn this on and check this here. And then you can also post as a company. Here you will simply need to put the URL of your company's LinkedIn. This part of the section is dedicated to targeting accounts that we want to constantly keep in touch with and write comments under their posts. So you will simply need to pass your URL of their LinkedIn account here. So let's say I want to target Bill Gates. And now you can move on uh, customizing build settings. You can choose to pause the automation. You can choose to turn on gifts and you can choose the maximum waiting day. So let's say I want to um, ride under uh, Bill Gates pause every other third day or ever for every other third pause. Um, so let's do this here. And um, now let's head to searches where we can target pause with specific keywords. Um, okay, uh, so here we've got three options of adding our keywords. Either we can use quotation marks, which will target the posts that contain absolutely this word. Um, let's say I'm a content creator and I want to connect with other content creators. Then I can choose the um, keyword content creator. Okay, so I can Plus this. And then we can use Boolean searches and and or for more advanced search methods. Um, okay, so once you've added up to three keywords here, um, then you can also do the search settings configurations. So let's see what we can do here. Uh, we can post the automation if we want to post comments, no more. And then we can also turn on GIFs. Yes, for more friendliness and for more informal tone, you can definitely go with GIFs. Um, and it will make more memorable. Um, okay, so we've chosen our um, settings, account settings to search uh, keywords and then we've done also the search settings. Let's see what is left. Of course, our tone. Let's see what we can do here. To personalize our tone, we're simply heading to this personalized tone section and here we've got plenty of options. So first of all, you will need to understand what kind of comment you want to make. Maybe it's regarding your um, sales or maybe you want to sell your services or maybe you just want to connect with people and that's it, expand your networking. Uh, so based on that, you will need to configure your tone and adapt it to your comment style. 
Okay, so first of all, let's choose an account. In this case, it's only my account. And then we can choose the language style, short sentences, complex vocabulary or passive voice, short sentences. Um, formality level, uh, I will be semi-formal. And then we can choose general emotion. It's, um, I assume, happy. And then we can choose a personality. I want to be humoristic. And then the questions frequency, um, let's say sometimes. And pronoun principle. Uh, at a first person or third, maybe first. And then feelings toward your work, optimistic. And the tone, it might be considering all the previous options, I will choose um, friendly. And then here you can also choose uh, five favorite topics. Uh, you can provide five adjectives that describe you and your writing. And then um, you can also provide four examples of comments that you have uh, curated. Uh, and it will automatically post them. And after this uh, four comments, you can save your changes and you have your uh, personalized style of writing comments. So you give this human touch your comments. And here comes the most interesting part, our results. And here you can see uh, the comments that have been made by Powering. And let's see what kind of information we have here. So we have the uh, search keyword that we have targeted. It is content creator, it is right. Then we have the account from which uh, the content has been made or is going to be made then you can see the post so let's click on one of these and you can see how relevant it is actually um, and then a comment that powering has made for us um, and you can see how it matches the content of the post that he has targeted and then um, you can see if you validate it you can see that it is now scheduled so you have the opportunity to see if this one is good to go so if you do not want you can definitely delete this but if it's go good to go then you can just check this and it will say that it is scheduled and you can see how many uh, options do we have here so it's pretty awesome. That's it about Powering, the tool that will take your networking to another level. And if you've got any questions concerning it, don't forget to drop them in the comments and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell to not miss out on any of our upcoming videos. See you next time and have a nice day. Bye bye.